<laughs> oh god. All right, here we go. Super Idol. Now where the frick is my water? I'm gonna take this sip. Uh, also, because uh, you uh, gave bits, you should have an awesome Zelda Kokiri Emerald next to your name. Alright, so without further uh, adios, let's play this. I don't know how long any of these games are. I have a couple of them in my folder. Uh, let's kick off November right by cranking through some of this shit. Welcome to Mario's house. Hop into the pipe and you're ready to play the level. This place has lots of secrets in it, so stick around and see if you can find everything. This is my first. Yeah, okay, there's like the credits. Shout outs. Yeah, your dad, your mom, and for letting me live there. Yo! Thanks for your gifted sub! Boom! boom. Thank you so much for the g -g gifted sub. Uh, that brings the subtotal up to 47. Dang, we just started. Appreciate it. Now Alea can use uh, her own freaking emote. <laughs> All right. So, what do we got going on in Mario's room? He said, "Jump in the pipe." Hey, go! Come on, Mario! Don't be falling asleep, bit. Dang, dude! Like I've always said this, chat, and maybe you guys are gonna be offended because this probably applies to a lot of you guys. What the fuck is that? Um. Hold on, my brain just hurt for a second seeing that shit. So, I always see pictures of people's rooms, and for me, like growing up, uh, how's the audio, by the way? Is it too loud, too quiet? Let me know. Um, growing up, I always had like a really expressive room. Like, I would always, my walls were always decorated with posters, and I had like bobbleheads and figurines and toys, and, and then I got older, and I like, I got anime figures and posters and wall scrolls and you know, lights, these LEDs, like, to me, like, my room is, like, my, my safe place, you know, it's, I want the things that I love to be reflected in my room, it's, it's my little cut of the world where I like to have some stuff, so whenever I see videos or pictures of other people's rooms, and it's just, like, bare white walls with, like, a bed in the corner, I always feel like they're, like, serial killers, that's kind of how I feel about Mario, like, this is his room, bro, what is that up there? What? He's, has he got a pipe leak? <laughs> There's actually a story about that really quick. Uh, when I was staying at my dad's house years ago. Now it's probably been six, seven years now. Um, that actually happened to me. I was sleeping and in my dream, I was getting splashed with water. And then I woke up and I, there was water on my face. And I was like, what the fuck, dude? And then I could feel drips. So I was like, my room is in the basement. And like, how, how is there a drip? So I couldn't see. So I fumbled. I turned on my lamp. And literally that is what I saw. Above my bed, the white ceiling had a dark spot. And I guess uh, one of the pipes burst. Uh, and it was leaking. And it was going through the drywall. It was like a nightmare, dude. I hated it. I saw that shit. And then I like touched it. And like water came out. It was brown water. All. It wasn't like shit. It wasn't like a septic tank. But it was like rusty water it was all over my bed sheets and my shirt it was like three in the morning i had to wake up my dad and be like can i sleep somewhere else but, yeah uh i reposted some of the art you were talking about in the discord nice i will look uh yeah well let me just look at some of it now before we get into uh a thingamajig we also have a fan art contest if you're interested um Alea, there's the bomb true girl. Yeah, there's the one I was talking about with Marie and uh, Rosalina and stuff. Uh, super cute. Um, we have a fan art contest going on right now. Uh, the deadline is uh, Sunday. And yeah, the theme is that uh, to create uh, kind of like an OC, you know, uh, whether it's a Mario character, a Zelda character, um, and to kind of like make an original version of them to add to the streams and then i will add that to uh i'll add that to our streams canon and then the winner gets a free sub if you're already subbed you get a free one month sub whenever your sub runs out so uh the winner gets a free month sub and there's no penalty it's just for fun and i like to show it off on stream too so yeah so unfortunately uh it is there is only six days left but i figured i'd tell you anyways so, all you have to do is uh, post it in the Discord and you're good. And it'll count. So if you want to make a, 
uh, version of Bomb True Girl where she's even cooler than already, then there you go. That'll be an instant win. No, I'm kidding. But anyways, back to Mario's uh, serial killer bullshit. Draw a stick figure. I don't give a shit. Whatever. It'll be funny. It'll be funny. All right. Something, something, ground pound sign. What? Are we doing this shit again? Well, hold up. What's this? He said to go into the pipe, but like, what happens if you jump it? Can you jump into this? Yeah. What? The, wait, what? Uh, Mario? You okay, buddy? <laughs> He's like, I'll, I'll get there. Is this Velcro? What the fuck? I don't understand. Whatever. All right, let's ground pound the sign. Wait, what? That happens to all the walls? What? Is this for like wall to make wall jumping easy? I have never seen it like this. I've seen it where Mario slides before, but this is like where you can like, he's like Spider-Man. Bruh, he's like Spider-Man, dude. <laughs> Except he's sticking like on the wrong side. Velcro implies Mario's face is also Velcro. No, his mustache is. This looks okay, but when he's on the other side, he it's reversed. What? what? He was not doing the reverse one anymore. See, that's not how that's not how that's supposed to look. Dude, that's that's not right. It's supposed to be facing the other way. But anyways, what did the ground pound sign? And do shit. <gasps> what? I was like, what'd that do? But he's missing his fucking leg! What the hell? <laughs> this is already fucking scuffed. We haven't even gone to the pipe yet. It's like back in back in Vietnam. <laughs> what the hell? Well, at least Mario can now legally park wherever he wants when he goes to Walmart. He'll fit right in. Do it again? Do you think it'll give me my leg back? No. <gasps> what? No! Dude, now he's got no legs! <laughs> Luigi, please kill me! Luigi, the gun is in my safe! If there's one bullet in there, please put me out of my misery! I'm begging you! Look, ma, no legs! What up, Rainbow Kappa? Dude, what are we doing to this guy? God. This is fucked up. How much more can we take from this man? I didn't know Month of Horror is still going. We're just dismembering Mario. Holy fuck. <laughs> no! What? No! What are we doing, bro? Dude, he's got Mario kind of got a dump truck, though. Look at that. He's packing. When, he, when, he, when he's uh, losing in arms and legs, he makes up for an absolute dumper. Like hangman, he thick, bro. Right, hold up. What? Edit 19811. So I made a last minute change about an hour before I submitted this because I originally programmed. Because what I originally programmed in might have taken this joke a bit too far, and I really don't want to risk being DQ'd for it. Nothing else will happen if you ground pound the sign. What? What is he gonna have happen? Mario's gonna be nudity? Well, how do we get our shit back, dude? How the fuck do we get our arm and legs back? What the f Can we investigate that rusty stain above his bed? Uh, what? Uh, what? He's going to sleep? Is that how you get your shit back? Ah, spaghetti. Ah, ravioli. Uh. How are they doing this? He still doesn't have any of his shit back. Can I go up here? No. 
dude. There's dead ass like nothing I can do to get up there. That's fine. Uh, it's probably not important. I was just a little bit curious. Fuck. So I want to see if I can get up in the rust spot. Ah, there's no way up there, dude. Alright, well. This is kind of scuffed. We ain't got a body, dude. Whatever. Mario's going in the pipe anyway. <laughs> Did he grab on with his mouth, bro? <laughs> He's like, oh! Come on, Mario. <laughs> dude, Mario's an inspiration to uh, people with disabilities everywhere. We could all, you know, learn a thing or two from him. What the fuck? Oh. What the fuck am I playing, dude? I'm done. <laughs> what the fuck? What is this Sunday shit? What the fuck is that? It's still not over? I thought that was gonna be the whole game. I thought that was the whole game, but there's actually dead ass more. Oh, not- oh, jaw. Oh, fuck, we're in for a journey now. How'd they do that? They got freaking Rick Roll playing in the Mario game? Running on N64? This is- this is crazy. I feel like we started with the best one. Oh my god, now I don't know what the hell to expect. Is this gonna be Troll World 2? Feels like it. Wall kicks are different in this game. When you hit a wall, you stay on the wall. Okay, that's what I was talking about. Uh, the, I, I'm not even lying, GMD. The game is just called A A A A A, like six A's. Just like ah. Uh. When I started, it just shows Mario just says ah. Uh. Oh fuck off. Oh, he look, He looks like a dart. <laughs> What the fuck, dude? Mario looks like you threw like a fucking sticky dart at the wall. Bro, you alright there, buddy? <laughs> what the hell? I didn't know we were playing the 3D All-Star or the uh, NSO version of Mario 64. Can I get the fuck off the wall, please? Where the hell am I? Okay. I don't know what the frick I'm supposed to do. Wait till we get to the bottom. Uh, whoa! Holy! <laughs> this is the best, dude. How can I still laugh playing these games? Out of all the hours I've spent playing Mario 64, how do I still get surprised by shit? This is gold already. Watch out, Chucky! Will eat you off the platform if you're not careful. Okay. How am I supposed to get this bullshit? Does it save my coin progress? A. S. Well, we don't know, GMD. Wait, there there might be like a nine and a half hour boss fight at the end of this. Every every uh, hack starts off fun. It's like the honeymoon phase. Every every Mario hack that we play, we're always like, "This is funny. Oh, I love this. It looks so good." And we're like. Yeah, this part's a little hard. They could have used a couple checkpoints here. And then then eventually gets to, like, I fucking hate this. This game sucks. Fuck Mario 64. That's how it goes. You start by loving it. Then you just accept it. Then it's just okay. And then you just fucking hate it by the end. So, it's gonna happen. Let's just go through the cycle. We're just gonna start things off with, Oh, this is pretty good. I don't know how to get this, though. Yeah. Any of you guys... Is there, there might be a switch or something. Uh, okay. Invisible wall. Um, because we cut off his arms and legs earlier. We were in Mario's house and you can cut off his legs and his arms. <laughs> and we dismembered him. <laughs> and then he went to sleep. Check. I only wanted to cut off his leg, but chat wanted me to just keep cutting off pieces of his body. What's this? Hi. Hold on, I want to go here first, then I'll go for that pipe. I don't know how to get that one red coin, though. There might be an invisible floor. You're, you're onto something. Let me just see if I even need these red coins. Wait, why does it keep saying one? Wait, what? Chat, am I going crazy? Didn't I collect that red coin down there? Am I going... Didn't I collect that red coin? Right? Is this game fucking with my head? Do the red... 
Do the red coins not mean shit? Hold up. Look at this game is like fucking gaslighting me, dude. I get a red coin and then the the old one comes back, so it says I perpetually only have one. What the fuck? This, what? This is Troll World 2. I hope there's no Jevil fight. We already joked about Jevil. Dude, you get a red coin and then the red coin goes back, so you feel like you're going mentally insane. Hell no, I'm freaking with it. No, dude, I hate this. I hate it. Because it's, it's back here. What the fuck? Get away from me, boom boom. How they do this? Is like messing with my head. How come people can figure out how to do shit like this, but people, uh, Nintendo can't figure out how to, like, get Ocarina of Time working properly on the Switch? That's what I'd like to figure out. We can cut off Mario's arms and legs and shit, but God forbid Ocarina of Time has, like, less than 500 frames of input delay. No! No! Come on! I actually got far! I didn't want to- Oh my god, I'm just- I, Why was I even getting a coin? We just established that the coins don't matter. We just established that coins don't mean shit, and I still screw it up. Also, my timer is, like, in my way. It's in my peripheral vision. Oh God. He didn't launch the way I wanted him to. Also, apparently lives don't matter, because I've, like, died six times and the life counter hasn't gone down at all. Watching Mario stick like a dartboard is like my favorite part of this. Whoa. That was a little fast, buddy. Is something gonna happen if I try to kill this guy? Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! It's hard to do shit without... He disappears? My head hurts trying to figure out what's actually going on in this game. My head hurts trying to figure this shit out. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. He like did teleport into a different reality. That was very peculiar. How did I get up here before? How did I get up here before? Am I drunk? I feel like it was easy last time, right? How did I do this? I did it so easily last time. What the fuck? I'm so confused now. What? 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 I don't understand. This game's making me do shit that I was able to do before. The game changed. Yeah, was it go a little taller? Well, I guess, I mean, it's not like this is that hard. You're trying to make sense of the tech- Okay, I overshot it, my bad. You're trying to make sense of the technical stuff? Well, the Chucky is gone. I don't know how that is. Even though I died, the Chucky is still dead. So he- I guess deaths are permanent. Now we're doing genocide rap. He goes a little fast, dude. Like, chill on that speed, son. Okay. Chucky is still dead. Uh... Like, did that platform lift up? It would not surprise me if that platform was was lower and now it's a little bit higher. Did killing that Chucky make this impossible? How did I do this? I don't. Well, it was. I did. I did it without even thinking. Did killing the Chucky make the platform be raised up? Okay, whatever. I don't care. We're up there now. That I, my head hurts. We're good. We're good. I, I, I don't know what's real and what's fake anymore. Gee, whoa, 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 whoa. He tried to push me off the top of the building, dude. Homicidal maniac. Damn it. It's hard to gauge shit when Mario has no arms or legs. It actually messes with my head. Like, it's hard to... Jeez, why does he slide like that? Yeah. I just tried to side flip. How did that happen again?
This is not even hard. None of this shit is hard. And I'm dying to dumb shit. Can't side flip on steep slopes? What was I supposed to do? I'll never try that again. Right. Don't go too fast, because then he, like, freaking goes nutso mode. Sometimes I get it, and sometimes I do not. There we go. Whatever. It's not, it's not that hard. It's just like a little... It's a little awkward feeling, but it's not like... No problem, Red. I don't even know what's gonna happen when you get back. I have no idea where we'll be in this. Mario will probably be like pregnant and shit. All these platforms are like just like high enough. No. No, Mario would never be pregnant. I just paid my life. Mom, he, he's making Mario pregnant in the game and he's not really... I can't go to school now. Backflip. I'm scared to die. Why isn't... Oh, you can't backflip on slopes either? I'm nervous. I don't want to fall off this thing again. Everything's really touchy. I don't want to fall off, please. <laughs> Come on! Get the fuck up there. Mario, you drunk? There we go. Alright. It's fine, we made it. Now read this shit. Shells are lava-proof, so you can ride them across here safely. Be careful. Be careful, though. You can speed up out of control when riding one. Oh, hell no. Oh, what is this? Jeez, why is this... Surface so slippery. Alright. I feel like I'm playing Rayman. Jeez, why'd you go so fast? I, I feel like I'm playing Rayman. Look at this. How do I stop it? Fuck. It's okay. We're good. Is this the star? Please, God. Or we're, was it supposed to go in the pipe? I don't know. We'll check out that pipe later. I just wanted to see what was going on with this. What the hell, dude? Thank you for the host. Mamma mia! Is this battle against a true hero? Is he not gonna talk to me? What is- what am I playing? How's Mario gonna pick him up? With his penis? And he's invisible. <laughs> this looks so random. <laughs> hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I got a perfect, I got a perfect song for this. I gotta mute the game audio. Hold up. Um, trying to find the song. Is this it? Here we go. Now that our VOD is muted. Uh, what happened though? Let me put my audio back on. I thought there was going to be a fight, but he's just like, we're just beating his ass. And I don't know where he went. Oops. 
cursor is on the screen. Oh, he respawns. Oh, now he's fighting? Now he's doing shit? Okay. Well, what am I supposed to do? Throw him off again? I have no idea. Any ideas, geniuses in the chat? What do I do? <laughs> wow, you, just get, you can't jump off either. Ooh. Is there something I'm missing here? understand where I could possibly have to go oh there we go there's a bomb in the middle oh what the fuck man it's gonna be hard I gotta do like a trick shot what how am I supposed to get that it's like directly in the middle of the fucking arena that's bullshit how do I even like I can't see without fuck I can't see anything. How am I supposed to get Bowser into that bomb? We're gonna be here all night. Like, what the fuck? It's like up in the center of the sky. Oh, what the hell, dude? We've been doing this shit for years. How's my water? Fuck it. This is incredible. Yeah, incredibly fucking garbage. <laughs> I want to get him near the edge because then his trajectory will be more towards where I need it to be. Alright, maybe this is good. I really wish I could fucking see what I need to do. Okay. Why is there no Lakitu cam? There's two Mario cams. What the fuck, guys? Can't do Lakitu cam for this bullshit? It's gotta like go with like Mario's like face in the right way. It's gonna be fucking years. <laughs> the fuck am I watching? Mario slides so long he looks... <laughs> he looks like an air-powered, like, vehicle. Steam-powered. It takes Bowser so long to get back to Earth. Dude, I can't even control the camera. There's no way I'm going to catch this because it's going to be random. Yo, I did it! Okay, well, yeah, fucking that didn't take nearly as long as I thought. Maybe I'm better at this game? Okay, that's a really weird position. What are you doing, Mario? I'm trapped. Tell me out. Yo, I added back the dab. What? Yeah? <laughs> you know, sure, man. What about that pipe, though? What about that pipe? It, it, what about that pipe that we didn't go in? That was certified weird. The music's kind of banging. I like this song. Is this 
This would be a good BRB screen. Mario's body just wiggling. All right, hold up. I want to go check out that pipe really quick. Let me check out that pipe really fast. And then we'll uh, move on to the next one. No, it was it was a pixelated Mario's head. It wasn't a cookie. It was Mario's head from Super Mario World. Okay. All right. All right. Well, now we have arms and legs. So that's good. Let's get the fuck and see what's in this pipe. I forgot about this and it got me again. I forgot that this happens. Oh my God. How did I forget about that? All right, we're going to try to get in the pipe. You got me fucking twice. How did I forget about that? What? I, my brain legitimately forgot that that was something that happened. Alright, uh... Okay. Let me just try getting in there from up here. It is so much easier to, like, control, like, Mario's shit when he's, like... You can see his legs, I don't know, it's hard to explain. Uh -huh. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just a dumbass. No, I actually never got grabbed by the Chucky. That's a good point. I grabbed him, but he never grabbed me. Let's see what happens. All right, come on, buddy. Hello? You doing all right? Is he gonna ever fucking get me? Does he ever come? Oh, here we go. Come on. Come get me. All right, so normal. It's normal shit. <laughs> Why was that normal? You just got me killed, GMD, you asshole. Now you're gonna shit again. But how come when I throw him, he goes into like a parallel, parallel universe? Bro, I just want to go in that pipe. I'm gonna just gonna try to get up high and then get into the pipe from up above. Well, you think that he glitched out because I, I had no arms? Let's test that theory out. Oh, you're right. Interesting. Ah. I wonder if me losing my arms was responsible for a lot of those glitches. Either way, I'm just going to try to get up and then jump into the pipe from up like here, maybe? Is there anywhere that's like closer? I'm not gonna even try with the shell. Think I can make it like a long jump here? I'll try. I'm gonna run down to do a long jump, try to get into the pipe. Yo, okay, are you shitting me? Dude, it's hard to explain, but this game is a weird thing where Mario, like everything's slippery, but at least we know we can get on there. Whatever, I'm not mad, at least we know we can get on there. But this game has this weird thing where like everything's slippery, like Mario just can't do a stop. So I just have to ground pound when I get there. He just started slipping his ass off. Well, no, that, I mean, that's something. I thought maybe he was going to put invisible walls around all... I just thought that the pipe was on a block that was surrounded by invisible walls, but... That doesn't seem to be the case. For some reason, I can only get on this platform when I'm, like, facing this way. It's, like, easier for me. I don't know why. Well, maybe not. Maybe I just fucking suck no matter what I do. There better be some crazy shit in this pipe. Can I fucking see? All right, let's see. <laughs> That's not what I expected. Ass paper. Kill 
five creeper? Four Koopa? <laughs> what the fuck? Now we're playing ass paper? I just realized what's fucking going on. Hold the fuck up. Hold up. Oh my god. Alright. Pay attention to the word creeper. Pay attention to the word creeper. <laughs> but this man's a fucking genius. Who made this shit? <laughs> well, listen to this. Hold up. Look. <laughs> And it goes, and I'm just sitting down. So we back in the mine, got our pickaxe swinging from side to side. side what the fuck? This is great. The Saskatoon ruling one hope to find some diamonds to <laughs> diamonds tonight. Well, Heads up. you hear a sound, turn around and look. <laughs> this is fucking. Holy shit. What? <laughs> that was it. Holy fuck, man. This, that was worth it. I'm so glad we went in that pipe. I, I don't know if I can, like, do any of this shit if this is just a... Oh! It's, it's silent. But that was like a debugging room. Hold up. Hold up. I want to go in there one more time and I want to select something else. Give me a second, damn it. Ass paper. <laughs> I'm gonna save state when I get in that pipe, and I just wanna see if any of the other places take you to anything. I'm guessing not. They probably all take you to Rick Roll or something. Well, well let me just see. My curiosity has been piqued, which doesn't happen very often when I play these damn games. Usually I just wanna see the ending as fast as humanly possible. Why is he so fast? Why is he so fast? Fuck off. Sweet. I am safe stating here because we already beat the game, so I don't give a shit. I just want to see if this leads to anything else. That's creeper. Oh man, let's just try the mine. Okay, so it's just a whole bunch of different things. What's up, killer noob? Nice to see you. All right, I think we're good on this game. We we checked out everything that we possibly needed to. Okay, that was uh, a a a a a. All right, now I have to uh, hold up. Oh jeez, oh my goodness, I was having a bunch of freaking technical problems. All right, let's uh, let me boot up the next one. And we'll continue this journey. I didn't expect that one to take that long. I, I don't know. Some of these games take five minutes. Some of these games take five hours. I, Troll World, somebody told me it was like, oh, it's two hours. And it was like a nine. It was like, no, it was like 15 hour playthrough. <laughs> they were like, here's two hours. It was 15 hours it took me. And half of it was one boss. So I don't trust anybody when they tell me like how long or short one of these damn games are. All right, let's move on. Tomorrow. Here, I'll change the, change the logo.
There we go. The SM64 hacks logo. All right. Let's see what this is all about. The fuck? Is this Scream 64? No, it's it's Mischief Makers. What the hell? Remember we played this for N64 Madness? This was one of my childhood favorite games! Dude, I- it's Marina! This was one of my first video game crushes! She's an android anime girl! Dude, I love Mischief Makers! They got our actual audio! And the guy's like, Help me, Marina! Holy shit, dude, we're playing Mischief Makers? It's probably better than the actual damn game. Remember you grab the guys and you're like, shake, shake, and you steal them and beat the kids and shit? Holy shit, dude. Mischief Maker 64? This is her room. Hold up. I gotta show you guys the intro to Mischief Makers now. Because they, they recreated uh, the professor's room. That's cool. It's one of my favorite Nintendo 64 games. And the music's cool. I think this is it. If not, whatever. Shut up. Shut up. Alright. No, no, no. Here we go. Probably gonna be a cringe-ass lord ad. No, it's not. Cool. Ad-free. Dang, this was made by Enix before they were even bought by Square. Treasure helped make this too? Damn. I played this for N64 Madness, but it, the controls sucked absolute dong. But uh, back on Nintendo 64, this was great. Ah! Dude, look at all these sick bosses, Birdman, big angry guy. I was just trying to show the part with the apartment. Super underrated game. Super, super underrated game. Is there a part where it shows the apartment? No, of course not. Whatever, you, you get the point. They made, they recreated it. 1997, holy shit, dude. Alright, well, here we go. What are we gonna experience? Planet Clancer! Yeah! We actually have a video, if you guys wanna see, on our main channel called Welcome to Clan Ball Land. Yeah, I forgot. We have an entire. We have an entire main video on the main channel called Welcome to Clan Ball Land, and it's me playing Mischief Makers. I forgot about that. I forgot I uploaded a whole actual edited video of Mischief Makers like two years ago. Let's see if I can find it. This is blasting me with nostalgia. Yep, two years ago. Uploaded it October of 2019. Here come the ghost face Nazi army. <laughs> I love how that's the first thing I say. Here comes the ghost face Nazi army. Bro, how the fuck did we have 30 viewers for mischief? Man? What the fuck? Holy shit. Sorry, I'm gonna play. Here's the video though. How the fuck do we have 30 viewers for mischief makers? Alright, whatever. Here we go. Holy shit. It's the same music professor got stolen again. That old man never gets a break, doesn't he? Well, it wouldn't do any good just standing there. Besides, I'm starting to get kind of bored. Peaceful lifestyle is not my cup of tea. I probably should have checked that PC inside the house first, though. Well, oh. Hey, what am I trying to do? No time for slacking off, Marina. I gotta save the professor. Though I'm kind of hungry. I hope they have something to eat on this planet. Bitch, I, he told me to check the PC. Hold up, I'm resetting this because Marina said to check the PC.
Which one's the PC? Good thing Professor made that tracking device for cases just like these. Let's see. Imperial Headquarters. Doesn't sound all that friendly. Once I get there, I'll have a word or two with who runs that place. What's that, a text file that says read me? I guess I'll read it. Oh. It was made by someone named Zinus22. Without their help, it wouldn't have been possible. Shot some clips. What is that supposed to mean? Okay. Zinus. This is gonna be hard. Dude, I love Marina, she's cool. I'm not gonna collect all these damn crystals, but they look nice, they're... What, is that Toad, or what is that? Oh, it's a Clancer! Oh my gosh, that looks horrible! Ugh, ugh, what the fuck? Hey, who are you, a professor? I did saw some suspicious looking guys take an old man somewhere. Everybody's talking like they were in Horror Tale. That's him. I can't say for sure, but I think they hand it to Megan's shrine. I think your best bet would be to go there. Okay. I do love the music. It's super nostalgic to me. Let's kill this innocent. Boom! You go, Marina. Don't let anybody tell you who you can and can't murder in cold blood. This is fun! It is kind of cursed, so I guess it does fit the cursed Mario hacks, but it's more fun than cursed so far. I saw this weird guy with some shovel, uh, with, with, I can't even read it. I saw this weird guy with a some shovel time ago. What the fuck? At least it's not me. He said he's gonna go real high, as high as he possibly can. Because that way nobody will find his treasure. Isn't he such a weirdo? Don't ever talk to me again. Mischief makers, dude. It's a big ass area. This is fun. Can we cut off Marina's arms and legs? I don't want to do that. She's an android, guys. It's fine. She doesn't feel pain. Oh my gosh, look at the shy guy. The shy guys have the, the clanster faces. <coughs> That's a really cool health bar. Shit, I wanted to read that sign. Damn it. Nice, landed right on top of it. If you fall down, there's a recovery heart in the center of the island to help you get juiced up again. So we, you know me, I like getting juiced up. How many of you guys in chat juice up? I think it's a pretty cool thing to do. <coughs> oh, why am I coughing? Damn, Debra, you not juicing, bro? Lame. Top news. A new toy just appeared on the market. A replica model, a replica model of Professor Theo with over 36 articulated joints, including the mustache. Why it was made, nobody knows, but I'm sure as heck don't want it. But if something like that is up your alley, it's just 100 crystals for the set. Is that a really complicated way of saying that uh, I should collect all 100 crystals? Because I wish I would have known that before I skipped like a shit ton earlier on. They should have maybe put that sign maybe at the beginning? Huh? If Nintendo ever brings Mischief Makers to Nintendo Switch Online, then I'll buy it. Just because, like, that game is, like, it's one of the hardest N64 games to, to play on an emulator. Like, no emulator settings I've ever found. It's too niche to where nobody gives a shit to patch it. So if Nintendo ever, uh, patch it, then I'd play. Should I even go down there? I don't know if I care about collecting all the crystals. Hopefully it's not mandatory. I'm getting a little nervous because if I fall, that's a lot of shit I gotta do over again. We're so close, Zach. Come on now, don't, don't choke. Every fucking time. I'm incapable of not choking on my stream. I'm incapable of it, dude. I always choke under the pressure. Every fucking... Where was the health sucker-upper? Hey, asshole. How about instead of giving me a recovery heart, you just add a checkpoint, dickhead? 
Actually, I'm pretty close to 100 crystals. Maybe this is a good thing. Maybe I can use some crystals. But I don't give a shit about a figure of Professor Theo. If it was like a, a cast-off Toga figure, absolutely, I'd pay 100 crystals for that shit. I don't give a frick, frick, frick about Professor Theo. You the choke master? Um, I think that you had me confused with your mama. What's up? You thought Month of Horror was over? Dude, this is not horrifying. This is amazing. Mischief Maker 64, even though that's a stupid name because Mischief Makers was on N64. But whatever. Oh, uh, whoa, well, what, 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 what? Should I have gone the other way? Is that what I did last time? Whatever. Marina does what she wants, dude. Can't stop the haters. I think I just made this harder for myself, though. want to be deactivated this model looks really good though look at this they got like her eyes blinking and everything if i could actually see her look at her they did a pretty good job i mean yeah she kind of does look like a south park character but whatever eat shit we gotta fill up her juices anyways Yes, welcome anybody. We're playing some cursed Mario 64 hacks. Some nightmare shit. Uh, but I like it. I'm having a good time. I got so used to the wall kicks from the other game, those spoiled me. You had to do some computer stuff because your dad dropped his phone into the toilet bowl. I never dropped any electronic into the toilet bowl, but I had a friend who dropped his Game Boy Advance SP into the toilet while he was pissing into the toilet because I guess he was playing while pissing. And he dropped it and then continued to piss on it because you just can't stop. Like, you, it's not like you can just turn it on or off if you want. You know, you can delay it, but it's gonna happen. Um, and then he just had, he just pissed on it, and then uh, it still worked. It still worked. Is that crazy? Old Nintendo hardware is durable as shit. Like the Wii and and then the Game Boy and the original Brick DS. Like those things. Those things had some durability to them, for sure. Hold on. I'm gonna go up this way again. Because I skip a lot of these block jumps if I do that. I was like, this dude literally pissed on his Game Boy and then kept playing it. <clears throat> yeah, right? Same thing with, like, the Wii. Like, my Wii console got kicked over and knocked over a million times and it's fine. If I knocked over my Xbox 360 once, that motherfucker gone. It survived a bomb blast. Oh my gosh. Muda, muda, muda. There we go. Jeez, should not have been that hard. But now, can there be a checkpoint or something, please? Get out of my way, clan ball people. Shit, I forgot that I should be collecting these things. For your little assholes, double kill. Okay, I see how it is. Come over here. I'm 15 gems away from the limited edition figure. Cha-ching. Heading towards Megan Shrine, right? If yes, then you're on the right track. 
keep on going and you'll see the entrance. It's quite hot inside, so don't burn yourself up there. Dude, how much longer is there? I don't want to fall down again. Look at all this bullshit was that. All right. The render distance is a little scuffed, but that's okay. Whoa! Controls are a little touchy. Five more crystals we need. Come on, Marina. You got this, Marina. Please. Now we're good. Five more crystals, really? Is there not five more? There we go. There we go. Three more crystals. Are you shitting me? Please be one more. Are you shitting me? One. There's the entrance. I'm one. Come. This happens every fucking time. One crystal short because I accidentally killed that clan ball guy. This is some whack shit, dude. Whatever, I don't give a fuck about that limited edition figure anyways. That's like there was this figure I wanted so bad. There was this anime figure that I wanted so bad. And I kept telling myself, I was like, I should just pre-order it, I should just pre-order it. And then I never did it. And then finally, you know, I got paid. This was, you know, a year or two ago. And I got my paycheck. I was like, you know what? I, I made a little bit more than I thought I would this month. I'm going to treat myself. I'm going to pre-order that anime figure. Literally the day I go onto the website, sold out. I'm gone. I'm pissed. So Now, it's it's available on the second-hand market, but it's way too expensive. People are selling it for like 300 bucks. I ain't paying 300 bucks for that bullshit. No, no, no. Not going to happen, chief. How am I supposed to get over here, though? This looks kind of like a hard jump. Is anybody else, like, nervous that I'm gonna make this? Like, how- this is- this looks pretty far away, dude. That's not how you do it. Please. Okay, wow. Are there any crystals around here? Please? No? Nothing? You couldn't have thrown me a, a crystal or two? I didn't say no, I am fucking- it's no Astolfo figure, bro. Hell no. It was a zero two. Uh, what? Whoa. Wait. Oh, my crystal reset. I was like, wait a second. It's not over. My crystal reset. This lava is going by fast as shit. I feel like we're in space. This is really cool, though. Just... These platforms remind me of Hexagon Heat, objectively in the top ten best Mario Party mini games of all time, where you where Toad like lifts up the flag and you gotta like run to the right platform and everybody's going, "Dude, I wanna play!" Dude, I actually got it right here. Check this out, chat. Hold up, let me pause. I was knocked over my PC. Um, I haven't. It's still the cellophane wrap. Um, Teflon, you son of a bitch. Where did I put it? Somebody stole it from me. Right? Come on, I don't have that many Switch games. Where the fuck is it? There we go. Boom! I got it, but it's still the cellophane ramp. I got the Mario Party remake, dude! You, you're a uh, roommate guy, too? You've been playing Yoshi's Island in Spaceland? Normal November? Let's go! Yeah, normal November! Uh, we've been playing some cursed Mario shit, uh, but I got Mario Party remake! If any of you guys have uh, Nintendo Switch uh, and you have this game, add me and I'll play with you on stream and we'll get prizes and shit. It's still in the wrap. Want to know another game I bought but I never played? I bought it. I haven't had time, dude. I've been streaming and working my ass off. And plus, I've been, like, sick and trying to watch anime and shit. Been a busy-ass little bit, son of a bitch lately. Uh, this is also the cellophane plastic, right? Metroid Dread. <laughs> um, Want to know something crazy? I got both of these games for 40 bucks each. I got both of these for 40 bucks each. Isn't that nuts? So. Yeah. Because Walmart was doing a special thing 
Walmart was doing like a special promo thing and uh, they had like all new Switch games or PS5 games too were $20, $20 off. So, dude, everybody says the mini games are the, are the shit. So I was able to get these two awesome games at discount and they're both from the plastic wrap. Still haven't played them yet. They're going to be good. I just haven't had time. Yeah, yeah. Now, if you like, I looked on Amazon. This shit's sixty bucks each still. Uh, but luckily, Walmart had my back. Walmart cheaper uh, for these games for a limited time, and luckily, both those games came out in October, so I was able to make out like a bandit. Uh, can't wait to play it though. Can't wait to play it. I've just been busy, but now it's time to play Mario sixty four. Walmart always got cheap Switch games. Yeah, but not $20 off. Usually it's like 5 or 10 You gotta get Mario Party. It's like everybody says the best one in years. I have not really, like, I've liked some Mario Parties. Like, there, I had fun with 9. I had some fun with 7. Um, I never even bought 10 or Super. But um, the last Mario Party I, like, thought was amazing was 6. 1 through 6, so good. So the fact that this one is inspired by, like, the original trilogy... So yeah, yeah, it was, it was good, good shit. All right, yeah, so much to stream this month. Yeah, six had the microphone, but I loved it. One of my best memories. I'll try to talk and play at the same time. Hold on, let me, let me do this sick jump, and then I'll tell the story. Hell yeah, do my pew. Um. One of my best memories is I had uh, like I had a bunch of friends from school hang out, and like we had I had like six friends. It was me and six friends, so there were seven of us, and we had just a big hangout session at my house. We all like they all spent the night. We had pizza, we had Mountain Dew, and um, like we're sitting around playing some games or whatever. And I'm like, Yo guys, want to check out something cool? So I came back, and I bust. I was like, Look what I got. And it was Mario Party 6. The game just came out a few days ago. We opened it up. I was waiting to play till we were all hanging out. And we played Mario Party 6. We were having such a good time. I actually loved the microphone. We had so much fun with the microphone. There was mini games where you had to be like, jump up, down. And we were like passing the microphone to each other. We were like swearing and yelling and throwing chips. It was such a good memory. Such a good memory. Mario Party 6 was the shit, dude. It always understood us. We were just like, up, up, up. And then the game was like, oh, blah, blah, blah. Sometimes it, it was wrong, absolutely. It wasn't like perfect, but sometimes, most of the time it was pretty good. How am I supposed to get the fuck up here, dude? Really? Never mind. that's not even as hard as that. What the hell? That bomb looks sad, dude. Bro, somebody be that bomb's friend. <gasps> he just killed himself. No, he killed himself. Oh my god, I just said he needed a friend. Well, fuck. That was dark. How do we lighten the mood? Come on, Super Idol, help us out. Super Idol, the show, don't make me the chin by Joe, the young bong, don't make me yaw yaw. You're a bailing who do the knee, did he ching chin the jung liu shui? <laughs> Thanks, bro. He always knows how to cheer up the mood. Thanks for the follow, by the way, uh, Nevin. If that's your real name. Welcome to the Milky Finishers. We stream. Are you coming in here throwing links and shit? If this is not pornography, you're getting banned. Fred Flintstone dies. Pop, shoot that guy. Give him a fat 10 minute bullet for putting Fred Flintstone pornography in my stream. Thanks for the follow, though. Appreciate it. Have a good night, buddy. Enjoy your dirt nap for 10 minutes. Look, beat that guy ass. <laughs> Bruh. Well, sorry, Depri. Not everybody here wants to see Fred Flintstone's penis. I know you do, but not everybody does. Welcome back, Reb. You just missed Fred Flintstone's wiener. <laughs> We're playing Mischief Makers, dude. Isn't she kawaii this? Look at her arm. She looks like the cutest South Park girl I've ever seen. I do appreciate the follow, Nevin. If you're still back in 10 minutes, you can chat. It's only a 10 minute ban, you'll be fine. Think about what you did. Reflect on your actions.
That's fine. I might not like Astolfo, but I can respect it. More than Fred Flintstone, my guy? Fred freaking Flintstone. Nah, I ain't buying that shit. Astolfo, I get it. That's fine. Whatever. That might, that's not my thing, but I get it. You know what I mean? Shit! No, Marina! <laughs> no, Marina! <gasps> we survived. Bonnie? I don't give a frick about him either. Hey, it's our bomb buddy. He's back. Get out of my house. You're not allowed to suicide in my household. My dad said no taking my suicide bomb. <laughs> that was a reference to the kid who, uh, well, whatever. If you watch Resident Evil 4, you get it. If you didn't, you don't. Arena, Dayo. No, please. How am I supposed to make that last jump? These look like brownies, dude. Well, kind of. Maybe I just really want brownies. I wish I could eat them. <laughs> Come on, brother. No, please. Why does this game make you, like, jump up... Like fucking all the way to the top of a tower. Are you out of your mind? Okay, no, I thought. Oh, never mind. I thought I'd do the whole game over again. I had to. Never. Mind. It's not that big of a deal. I bet. We're speedrunning this shit now. Oh! Yeah -ha! I remember Mischief Makers was a first, uh, like a, only a one-player game. And my stepbrother, when he was really young, he always wanted to play with me. So I would just, I do what like everybody that has younger siblings does. I took in a second controller, plugged it in, and told him he was playing as the bad guys. And this dumb motherfucker sat there for like uh, six hours, just like, Mom, I'm the bad guys. And he just, he was, he was down. And I was just playing Mischief Makers on my own. I was like, that's fine. True story. I was like, I ain't taking turns, bro. You're, what, four? Yeah, you shit. You can be the non-existent player, too. Now these jumps are freaking me out. They weren't freaking me out before. Double jump is will suffice. Yeah, right. Well, hey, Pop, ignorance is bliss. He was having fun. He kept telling his mom, he's like, I was a bad guy, and he had his machine, and you like, he was having a great time, you know? He was, he was having fun, so, I mean, whatever. Ignorance is bliss. Nope. I did that with Ocarina of Time as well. I was like, oh yeah, you, you're playing as the horse. He's like, ah. Uh. Uh, how am I supposed to do this? This one... I don't understand this one. <laughs> yeah, he grows up and he's like, Dude, you can play as a bad guy. And then they're like, Are you fucking idiot? <laughs> I never even thought about that. Oh my gosh, how am I supposed to get up there, Chad? This is hard. Fuck me! Yes! Let's go. How long is this level? Let's find out. Holy shit. You need to read what I'm typing before you press enter. I've been doing that too. Lately I've just been typing so fast that like I, I have not even like paid attention to grammatical errors. How long is this game? Full ass game? Another level, I guess so. What is this? This is where I quit in N64, uh, N64 Madness. Because remember the D-pad, the controls weren't working right, so I couldn't get past that part? We have to jump from clan ball to clan ball? Well, here you guys go. I always told you one day I'd beat it, and here we are. Well, I don't want to jinx it. What if it's too hard? Well, okay, duly noted, you can't wall jump off those. I can't see Marina, dude, because 
She's sucked in the clan ball. Speaking of the clan ball's face, um, when I went to see the new Halloween movie last night, I saw a trailer for the new Scream movie, and I like how it's literally the same exact premise. What am I supposed to do now? I'm lost. Oh, there's another yellow clan ball up here. Uh, okay, my depth perception was a little weird. If I had a friend that told me to roleplay as any type of animal, I'd beat their ass with a 2x4. Probably why I don't have many friends. <laughs> How am I supposed to get to this yellow ball? Eh, like this. See? Camera... Camera control helps a lot, chat. Yeah, that SM64 camera kind of shit in the bed, but if I finagle it, I can figure out where I'm going. Whoa. Whoa, Marina, chill, girl. Did you guys hear about the, uh, the data leaks for, uh, Nintendo Switch Online? That there's code? So... Nintendo Switch Online for N64 launched with nine games, and in the code, they found that there's placeholders for 38 games. That's actually kind of exciting, because even in the best days, the Wii and the Wii U only ever had 21 N64 games available. So, 38 games, that's a pretty substantial library. If they could just fix Ocarina of Time, so it's not completely garbage, um, that would be cool. If they would have launched, if they would... Yeah, exactly, Pop. That's what I'm saying. But, like, people are thinking that they might actually do the impossible and GoldenEye multiplayer might be real because last week, Nintendo of Japan sent an appeal to Germany to try to get GoldenEye uh, unbanned. Because if you, if you guys don't know, the game GoldenEye 007 is actually banned in Germany. I don't really remember why. There's a whole thing about it or something. It, like, portrays Germany in a bad light or whatever, blah, 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 blah. But they actually... They sent an appeal to try to get that game unbanned. And why else would they do that unless it was to, um... Get Goldeneye on, on NSO. That's... That would be cool. That would be... freaking fun, man. I still stand by that I don't think NSO is worth it now, but if they add if they added all those games, dude, then maybe. And then just fix it. Just patch it. You patch the fog issues in Ocarina of Time. Increase the uh in uh, decrease no 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 uh decrease the input delay. Add some more games, and then we'll talk. Then I'll start opening up my wallet a little bit. Oh, they removed it from the van list? Oh shit, the plot thickened. I don't even care. I would just like to play local multiplayer, honestly. Shit, I'd play local split screen at that point. Or just 1v1 was fun back in the day, man. 1v1 online works good. It's just when you try to get four people from across the globe, it doesn't work. But people are, people are doing one-on-one -on -one like Mario Tennis and shit just fine. So that's why I think Smash 64 would actually... Come on. Smash 64 would actually be fine. Because it doesn't seem to have an issue with one-on-one. -on -one. Come on. If I fall one more time, I'm dead. Marina, please! Peepees. No, I couldn't jump because the thing ate my input. It's hard to jump on platforms that are moving upwards. Yahoo, yahoo. Come on, Marina, please. Marina, please. There we go. How much more of this level is there? Are you absolutely shitting me? How much more could they possibly do? Man, Squid Game ain't shit, dude. 
They want to. They want to see a real death game. They should play Danganronpa. All right. Squid Game ain't jack shit compared to the masterpiece of Kodaka. I ain't seen anybody in Squid Game that look nearly as cool as Ibuki Miyota. I need my shit. I hope that Danganronpa blows up again when uh, Danganronpa S comes out next month. Oh, dude, I need too much money. Guys, I need... How do I get more money? What do you guys want me to do? Sell my organs? I'm start selling some organs. Uh, I need to get Danganronpa Decadence. I'm so scared to die, dude. Yeah, it comes out next month. I'm so scared to die. The level that keeps on going forever and ever. <gasps> Except... Bro, is this where you fight Asgore? <laughs> every every game has an Undertale reference. Hold up. This is literally where you fight Asgore, dude. Hold up. Hold the fuck up. Quiet. Let me find this. That's literally the barrier from Undertale. I don't care what anybody says. <laughs> I like how that was the very first thing that popped into my fucking head. That was the very first thing that popped into my head. Holy shit. Hey, thank you for the sub. Pop, 46 months? Damn, dude. It's a long ass time to be watching this bullshit. I'm pulling up the image. Shut up. <clears throat> that would make sense because if you... Well, it depends. If you want to buy all the games, it's going to be 60 But it, they're selling on the eShop. You can buy just Danganronpa S by itself. I think it's 15 bucks. So if you if you want to just buy uh, Danganronpa S, they're selling it as a separate game on the eShop. But I'm crazy and I'm buying the special edition, so I'm getting everything. And I haven't played V3, so it's going to be worth it. Plus, I'd be fine replaying 1 and 2. Yeah, me too. I want all the games, so I'm getting all of them. Hell yeah, dude. For sure, but, like, it was already explained, and I think people are, like, overreacting about it. Because how it works is there is an in-game currency that you unlock by just progressing through the game. And all it is is for purely, like, cosmetic shit. So... They were literally like, Spike Chunsoft was describing it like this. They're like, either you can um, use the in-game currency to roll like this gotcha thing. And there's a 1 in 100 chance you'll unlock Swimsuit Nagito. Or for one ninety nine you can just buy Swimsuit Nagito. Shit like that. You can still play the whole thing without microtransactions. But if you want the swimsuits, you can either play a lot of the game and just keep rolling the gotcha thing. Or you can just buy it. That's what it is, so. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. But anyways, this this is the whole point. This is the barrier from... That's literally the fucking barrier from Undertale. Look at this shit. <laughs> this is the barrier. That's the first thing I thought of. That's the first thing I thought of. Everything is Undertale, chat. Everything is Undertale. This is the barrier, buddy. Wait a second. That's not Frisk. Who the fuck is that? Who's that bald son of a bitch? That's not Frisk. The hell picture did I find? <laughs> Whatever. Let's go to the barrier fight Asgore. Is there anything else to do around here? Nope. That's the guy from the Lisa game? What the hell? My stepbrother is definitely not bald. He's a... He's like a... He's jacked. He's got muscles. He's got a big tattoo of like an AK-47 on his thigh. You want uh, to fuck with him now. Wait, is this level one again? Where the fuck am I? Yeah, I don't know. He likes that gun. I don't know. Maybe it's not an AK-47. Maybe it's like an AR or something. I don't know. I don't know guns, guys. You're almost there. Just get into the cannon and shoot yourself into the center of the portal. What the hell am I doing here? Existing to tell you directions, of course. Fourth wall breaking meta funny. Is this where I came from or is this where I go? Cotton Najo. 
Whoa, dude! We're going to the nether? Okay. I'm gonna make a save state because I'm not gonna lose all my lives and have to play this whole game over again because of this. Come on, we gotta go to the barrier. Did it take this? Did it take this long last time? Uh, what the fuck is going on? There's a raccoon on the porch. What? Is the load busted? How did this work last time? Okay. Sure. I'm gonna save right here instead. That was weird. It's probably not canon because, well, I don't want to spoil. But the fact that those characters, some of those characters, they like, it shouldn't even be real. But. You, you might be getting your hopes up there, buddy. I think it's just like a fan service smorgasbord. It's just whack, dude. Come on, just get in the fucking black hole, Marina. What is happening? Why does the black hole look like this now? <laughs> Why would they like make you do this? Because it's like so hard to figure out how to shoot into the thing. Shoot to the wild blue yonder. I don't know, it's fine. There's not eyes, it's like metal Iron Man balls. I don't know what happened to the black hole, but that's like permanently scuffed now. Okay. Oh my lord. So this is the Imperial HQ. Professor should be somewhere nearby. Oh, what the hell? Yeah, they're like... It's hard to explain, but they're supposed to be like metal glass balls or something. You know, like Mega Man type shit. Come on, Marina. Yeah, it just looks like a big spaceship. Gaster? No, I'm sorry. <laughs> Fucking excuse me, buddy. Hello? So you've managed to get all the way here, Marina. I'm sorry, but I can't let you have the professor. If you want to get him back, you'll have to do it with your blood. Okay. I was half expecting like the yeah like the bomb wizard shit, but like it looks like this guy's just a little pushover bitch. Pfft. Wow, that was the easiest fight of all time. <laughs> Turns out I'm uh, actually kind of lame. Totally not because the creator doesn't know how to add custom code to the game. <laughs> all right, you can have the professor get out of here and leave me alone. Hey, there he is! It's the professor. Hey, bud. Damn, looking good, Chief. Let's go home. We got him. Oh, they're in the apartment. Okay. Nice. That was fun. 
Wow, Zach Lawliot has beaten two hacks in one night? What is this? No 900-hour boss fight? No frame-perfect jump that takes 500 attempts and chat gets mad that I don't use save dates on? Really? Crazy. Let's make it a third. Let's try another one. We're on a roll here. Up next, Howard's Escape. Sure. It's me, Mario. You don't understand the uh, Kotatsus? You're just supposed to just sit under it and it has a heater under there and it like warms your lap while you eat. And warms your whole body. Howard's Escape. Let's see what this shit's all about. Mario, what did they do to you, bro? <laughs> bro, Mario, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, we're in for some shit tonight. Dude, what's with all these weird-ass custom character models tonight? How are we skip? Okay. KD64. Thanks. Especially... Oh, so this is a shout-out thing. Okay. Now this is epic. This button disables the containment field for the alien's powerful tech. Don't press the button. If you're not authorized to aliens, this means you. Bro, they got other aliens in here? Wait, they just got toads in here, dude? You're out of your cell? Run, Howie, run. If you can get to the surface, you can escape this world. Damn, we're breaking out of jail? Who locked me in here? I'm not an alien. Is this like a security guard? Hey, you alien, get back in your cell. Hell no. Nah. We busting out this bitch. Let's go. In intangibility field disabled. Warning, alien technology stored in the green hazmat containers is now accessible. Are you sure you want to proceed? Let's freaking go, dude. These are fun. This is fun so far. This is a fun night. Damn, he looks so cool, Metal. Now he looks like an alien. What is this song? And I'm dead. Is that cold to you, taters, or warm? Because that's pretty much uh, the temperature where I live, too. Don't you clap for that, Depri. Yeah, it is the chrome dancing alien. Yeah, what's he called? And he like plays that song. Dame to casita. That's a different thing. Howard? Wait, that's what this is called. It's called Howard's Escape. Is that based off him? Elevator up. Surface. Down. Not the surface. Alright, easy enough. Up we go. Is that fucking Mega Mind in there? Yeah, it's close, but not quite. The oh, fuck, bro? What the Gummy Bear album? Be sure to buy the Gummy Bear album, available April third. Um, yeah, what is this, dude? <laughs> what the fuck is this? My room? How oh, they steal this poster out of my room? How do I talk to it? Why is this here? Why is this here? I'm so confused. Can you read the damn sign? Top secret machine that makes anime real? Damn! Oh, it's out of, oh, it's out of fucking order, dude. It, t it makes uh, anime real. But shit's busted. Piss. Hold on, someone texted me. I gotta check my phone. Damn. Yeah, I like sweatshirt weather. I'm not wearing a sweatshirt now, but whatever. It only works on Attack on Titan. I would be happy to bring some of the characters from Attack on Titan to the real world, but I would want to go to the Attack on Titan world. I'd bring Annie here. Hell yeah. It only rains the Titans? Well, never mind. Well, actually, no, never mind. We have, uh, like, the U.S. military and shit. 
We'd be fine. This is a really weird song because it's like Babom Battlefield, but like not quite Babom Battlefield. Kind of dig it. A lot of vertical momentum in these games tonight. You know what I gotta do, which, which I haven't streamed in a while? Dude. Yeah, okay, then you have to fight me for her. You can have any of the other characters. Hibiki is my favorite. We have to, we, well, we both have to fight uh, Miu. Miu wants Hibiki the most. Or whatever, what's her name? Is that her name? God, it's been a lot while well, I've played Simple Gear. I know Chris, Hibiki, and Tsubasa. Her name is Miu, right? Hibiki's fucking girlfriend. If I had a superpower, what would it be? Uh, I don't know. I have no idea. It's very hard to, to say. Superpower, what would I want? I guess invisibility? Time stop? I don't want to fly. Shit's too scary. Is it me? Uh, no, I gotta look this up. How do I not remember? I've watched four seasons of that shit. I love it, and I can't remember. Simple Gear. Yeah, her name is Miku. Okay. Miku. I don't know why I don't remember. Well, she was barely in like the first season. Shut up, taters! Fuck you! I'm pissed about that still. I was supposed to go to Miku Expo in 2020. I just wanted to see how to Miku in concert, man. Oh, what is this? Oh, what? I gotta do like a crazy... Wait, can I cheese this? Hold up. Whatever. I can just... I just cheese this. What the fuck? Was that, like, did the developer really not think about that? They wanted me to do this long jump over the gap shit. I could just do this. Eat shit, dumbass. Um, whatever. I may not have gotten to see Hatsune Miku live, but I was able to watch hours and hours of Miku Miku dance videos. So, that's filled in the hole in my heart. You think you can get out of the one and only Area 51? Think again, you little alien punk. They'll have to scrape you off the floor when I'm done with you. How many times do we have to fight you? Womp boy. Usually we have to... Like, everything's, like, weird. Everything's, like, under swap today. Usually we have to fight, like, a bunch of King Babam ripoffs. Today it's been, like, a bunch of just Womp ripoffs. Which is, like, infinitely easier. Oh nuts. Fuck! <laughs> Still going. All right. Uh, what? What's the, what? Is, what is in the distance? What the hell? What the fuck is that? The mothership? That looks nuts. Is this is this gonna kill me, quicksand? Oh no. Well, color me surprised. I thought for sure that shit was quicksand. You want another Miku figure? I like Hatsune Miku. I'm not like the hugest Hatsune Miku fan. I'm not like diehard crazy, but I like her. I feel like every weeb likes Hatsune Miku a little bit. Can you stop dicking around? Oh my god, I'm so dumb. I'm so stupid. I screw up the easiest shit. Oh, uh, what? There are Hibiki figures. I think that they're sold out, though. How far am I into My Hero? Uh, I've finished... Oh, fuck! I finished Season 3. So I watched Season 1, 2, the movie, and Season 3. That was a horse shit. I really want to see the new movie in theaters, but I'm scared of spoilers. 
It's out now, and I kind of want to buy tickets for like tomorrow or something. I really want to play it or watch it, but I don't want to get spoiled. But I want to see the new movie in theaters be so hype. We better hurry. There's not. It's not going to be in theaters many days left. I think Thursday is the last day. Which is bullshit, because the Demon Slayer movie was in theaters for like five months straight. It's like, really, dude? Well, luckily it doesn't take too long to get back to where we were, but that death was still bullshit. It like spawn killed me. Like I was just dying over and over in like an endless loop. What the fuck are you talking about, GMD? Kind of weird kind of lie, kind of Kotaku article did you read to find out that information? Mario is from Brooklyn, New York. Okay. We're back. Why'd they put like one coin here? I don't understand. Itsumi. Is that supposed to be like a pun or a joke? Uh, no, Pop. Well, okay, technically Pop's right, but that got retconned after Yoshi's Island. So what happened is Mario and Luigi were born in the Mushroom Kingdom. Then... They, uh, fell into a warp pipe when they were still babies, like they were less than a year old, and then they grew up in Brooklyn, New York. They lived their life and grew up, and they made the Mario, Brother, uh, Mario Brothers plumbing industry. Uh, the events of Donkey Kong happened with Pauline and everything, and then one day they got a call to work on a sewage line, and that sewage line brought them back to the Mushroom Kingdom. But they don't have any memories of, the, of them being there when they were kids. The events of Donkey Kong is just that Donkey Kong came from the, uh... Donkey Kong came to Brooklyn, New York and kidnapped Pauline. And then Mario rescued Pauline. But then Mario forgot all about Pauline when he, uh... Went to the Mushroom Kingdom. I don't know, he probably wanted to have sex with her or something, I don't know. Why did King Kong take that one girl? I fucking know what the hell he's thinking. Why do people kidnap people at all? I don't under, I don't know. How am I supposed to fucking get up here? What's with all these hard ass jumps late today? What's up, Parks? Welcome to Cursed Mario shit. We're we're playing as an alien trying to bust out of prison. GMD, I need your help. How the fuck do I get up here? All day today, I've been doing these dumbass jumps. Just do it better, but it's like, what? I don't want to die again, because then I have to do all that shit over. Use Cappy? Shut the fuck up about Cappy. There we go, I did it. I did it without any of your help. So eat, donk, city. Hey, there's a star. Hallelujah. All right, come on. Does that mean we get to go home to our home planet? Poor Howard. Don't you die here, Zach Lolliot. I know you're the ch- master but not today bud can you just not be the choke master for one game Sweet. I don't know I don't want to risk it there's still more dude we we're busting out of area 51 that's where we're at well that's not cool cool mountain but yeah holy shit area 51 we're free dude Run, Howard, run! Run, you son of a bitch! Where's that kill when you need him? Come on, get the fuck over the fence! The game's lagging. The game's lagging hard. Holy shit. Run, Howard, run, Howard, you son of a bitch! You'll never catch me, 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 me. There's a spaceship! Out of my fucking way, make sure to commit homicide before you leave. Boom! Okay, never mind, they don't die. I, I use my DualShock 4. I got the very blue DualShock 4. That's what I play PC games with. Oh, what is this? 
Oh, what the fuck? My ship's right there. You really gotta make me do this crazy block jump before we leave? Fucking of course. Of course. That was bullshit. Clip that. That was bullshit. He was not even close to being dead. That was nowhere even near death, dude. What the fuck? Yo, what's up, spaghetti? Did you know that Papyrus has learned to make spaghetti? Death barrier moment. Get the freak out of my house. I just want to get back to my spaceship. Eat shit! Okay. Whoa, I didn't even see it do the bounce around. I'm the shit, boy. I'm the shit. Let's go. I'm legit. I'm the shit. I never fucking quit. Let's get on the ship. How do I get on the ship? I don't know. I remember Bean 500, whatever the hell the name is. Whatever you said, I remember it. so much for to playing my game. <laughs> hey, Lamal. Wow. Another uh another game down for the record books. Now your spaghetti? I like that name. I think that's pretty good. I think Oh, I got the hiccups again. Even though you lost that bet, I think spaghetti is a pretty cool name. I like spaghetti. Can't really eat it now, but. All right, that was uh, Howard's Escape 64. That was fun. That was a good time. I can't believe how many of these games I'm just beating. Wow, I'm freaking shocked. All right, but now is the final game of the night. Or not the night, but this is the final Mario hack of tonight. Uh before we move on to the next thing that we're doing. So get ready. This is the, the magnum opus. I've been saving this for the finale. You guys are not ready. Ready? Check this out. Here we go. Time to take a piss. What the hell are you doing? I'm taking a piss. Okay, but why aren't you jumping at me? That's what you're supposed to do. I might do it fucking later. That was Mario pissing. No, <laughs> I'm a mother- <laughs> Dear God, why? <laughs> What's wrong, GMD? You never seen a man piss before? Never seen Mario take a piss before, man. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh... I uh, think that's it, though. 